Ladies and gentlemen, Alex Jones here with a maximum alert. Last week we were contacted by Army personnel, by MPs, and then by Air Force MPs about United Nations advertisement solicitations that were being hung up in the barracks to recruit them for gun confiscation during collapse in America. That happened about a week and a half ago almost. Then in the middle of last week, we were sent the United Nations career advertisement that just went up by the same people saying, look, we've looked into it, here it is, for during a collapse, gun confiscation to stabilize things. And the RAND Corporation came up with a plan 20 years ago for this national stability police force. This is what the UN does worldwide. They've taken everybody else's guns. You understand? This is what they do. And it's in their own documents. They want it. Now it's broken. Now we were waiting on the report, not to confirm it, but to get undercover information, which we're getting right now. And it shows how great the alternative media is that DrudgeReport.com already had it last night uh, that the, you know what, they hit the fan plan with Max Slavo broke it. It's awesome. We are ferreting out even more confirming the specifics, but they admit in their own career plan right here, disarmament, demobilization, and reintegration officer. These are commanders to carry this out, and it gets into all of it. Small arms disarmament, their mission, uh, they've got to have serious command, uh, you know, from third world takeover operations that they've done in other countries. Here's the article on Infowars.com, mirrored Max Slavo, and he goes through it all. I've got Paul Watson doing a more detailed article showing the whole history of it. Now, let me show you this. We broke this a few months ago, so did the New American. DOD director provides for a federal authority in quelling civil unrest. Then... Look who ends up carrying it, the London Guardian, just a few days ago, Pentagon preparing for mass civil breakdown. Type in civil unrest, click Google News, ladies and gentlemen, and you will see this literally everywhere. The armored vehicles, the drones, the tanks, the preparations, using the border collapse that's just begun like a tsunami. Sheriffs have called it like Katrina every day to bring down those areas and then to basically bring in civil emergency or martial law. Food prices are doubling. Everything is starting to get more and more hardcore worldwide and here. This is the globalist collapse, Cloward and Piven, problem, reaction, solution. But getting this out and exposing their, that they're preparing for it will cause a public debate and they will fail. That's why they want to deny the NSA spying and deny all the things they're doing and deny they're funding Al-Qaeda and ISIS because then there can't be a debate about it. We're going to force the debate. We are the real media. We are the true media, not the state-run media. And this stuff is getting out regardless of what happens to InfoWars. There's Drudge and so many other great outfits out there that know the truth and care about freedom. And great job uh, to Mac uh, uh, getting this out. Again, we've got a big story on this with video, audio we're working on right now. It'll all be covered on the radio today, 11 a.m. to 2 p.m., InfoWars.com. If you're watching this transmission, you are the resistance.